strange being back here. You remember Star Labs? I remember everything. This is where we came up with the cerebral inhibitor to use against the bow. Who? Oh. <laughs> you haven't gotten there yet. What is good YouTube, Watch you here with a video on The Flash Season 4. So no worries guys, The Flash Season 5 has actually been confirmed by Discussing Films, who is a pretty cool page on Twitter. They have confirmed that we are getting The Flash Season 5, but whoever thought different. So I was sent this image by a subscriber that is pretty interesting and initially I thought it was actually fake because I went online, looked on Instagram, looked on Twitter and it wasn't anywhere. So I was sent it on Instagram in a private DM so then I looked for it myself and the only place I could actually find this image was by googling if you want to see it yourself is googling cerebral inhibitor the flash Tom Cav so is this image actually Tom Kavanagh, aka HR, aka Harrison Wells Earth 2, aka Harrison Wells Earth 1, but this version is actually HR. No, it's not joking. It's actually Earth 2 Harrison Wells Harry. So you could infer that this image does look like it could be the cerebral inhibitor. Now I know what you say and we haven't seen it, but in episode 23 last season, Barry Savitar did say this is where we created the cerebral inhibitor. Oh, you haven't got there. And that is when he name dropped DeVoe. Now, if he's speaking like it's actually factually going to happen and in his timeline it's already happened i mean he was already right about devoe so is the cerebral inhibitor actually going to be the device that actually brings down clifford devoe aka the thinker who is currently in hazards aka becky shark's body that is pretty interesting so also you could infer that this object does look pretty similar to the original thinking cap but it's going to be quite interesting so if you remember the episode in season three of the flash where team flash stopped barry allen from having any actual memories supposedly that is actually an early version of the cerebral inhibitor obviously the thinker has a very high level and intelligence level due to his meta human abilities so in theory all they have to do is come up with a device to block it which i presume will be clifford Defoe's kind of they're going to take clifford devoe down by using a cerebral inhibitor now this is where the theory comes in play if this device is the cerebral inhibitor where is it going to come from so we know barry allen came out the speed force in episode one now i think mystery girl i think the language that she's typing in is the key to working out how to stop devoe but also the key to figuring out everything behind the speed force now the problem with this tv show is they don't actually explain anything about the speed force to us so unless you read comic books you still are clueless because they're not using comic book logic so is mystery girl really the key to figure out how to reprogram something that they've already made before because in last season when cisco had to re-engineer stroke reprogram something to help splice um savitar in every sense in existence in every timeline essentially that was the overall plan what savitar wanted to do if he could do that then why couldn't he program and engineer something to stop clifford devoe's powers because obviously it's going to be the fastest man versus the brainiest man alive but so far this is really a kind of weak and underwhelming season so i'm hoping it will actually pick up so do you guys think this could be the cerebral inhibitor and if so who will develop it now i know a lot of people were going to say it's the mechanic um but i don't really think the mechanic needs to do it because we have harrison wells very intelligent guy we have Killer, Killer Frost, Caitlin Snow, very intelligent. We have Cisco. We have a very clever team. Do we really need the mechanic's wife to betray her husband in order to bring down DeVoe? Which I think she's going to do ultimately because he started to kill for the sake of it. And now we all know that it's looking likely that Clifford DeVoe's final plan is 
to actually kill Ralph or not well maybe not kill Ralph but take Ralph's ability off him like he has been taking the abilities and killing all the other metahuman in Iron Heights hence why he got Barry Allen sent to jail because Barry knew Barry would do something like that so we know he's most likely going to use Ralph's body to allow himself to transform into Clifford DeVoe's original body so his wife will actually love him again without um, Becky uh, it's, it's getting confusing guys because we got like Clifford DeVoe now in Becky Sharp's kind of the hazard's body so in the last episode, the thinker used the tears in order to kind of make his wife love him again. So it's a bit shady because the thinker's got all these abilities, but it's not clear what abilities he can use. We still know he can use the psychic abilities whilst using Becky Sharp's abilities, whilst using the tear ability. So it's very interesting, guys. And whether this is the cerebral inhibitor, it's up for discussion. So I want you guys to comment down below what is this device because i think harrison wells should be pinnacle to this because at the moment they are not using him at all i don't understand why the best character in season one he was reverse flash such a strong character in season three playing hr such a strong character in season two why are they not using one of the best actors on the show if not the best actor uh, well, he's probably the best actor with, with Grant Gustin, to be fair. Why are they not using the most intelligent person on the show against Clifford DeVoe? Now, it was speculated and rumoured beforehand that the thinker was going to use Harrison Wells against Team Flash because, realistically, Harrison Wells is the only intelligent person that can really stop the thinker. Although, when they had the Council of Wells, which was kind of a easter egg if you like that word towards the kind of the council of ricks from rick and morty um i mean i think the thinking knows that harrison wells could actually take him down so i think it would be interesting if they are going to tie mystery girl who everyone says is dawn allen although it's not being confirmed or explained in anyone's kind of interpretation it's just a character that appeared and she yes she does know this secret equation but that doesn't make a dawn allen it doesn't make her one of the tornado twin it doesn't make a jenny it literally doesn't make her anyone it could literally be a female version of bart allen so guys do you think she's key to stopping the thinker because for for some reason she was writing the speed force language of the future code but anyway guys is this the cerebral inhibitor and is it going to be how they take out the thinker because it's not a case of killing him it's a case of draining him of his powers so he can't use it for this enlightenment but what is the enlightenment everyone seems to think online i've been doing some research and everyone thinks that he's going to ultimately try to take the speed force off barry allen but if he was that clever he would have already understood how the speed force worked and realized that ultimately he's going to fail because we already know he's going to fail because savitar basically said that to us anyway guys this is my video that i should have made yesterday but i didn't get around to it because i had other stuff to do um about possibly the cerebral hippotator being revealed in a behind the scenes image um i think it looks pretty legit but it, it's not from a reliable source it's from tumblr really but i was sent it on instagram so guys let me know in the comment box down below what do you think this image is do you think mystery girl is going to help him soon because obviously i think they're filming episode 16 now ish i know the next episode after the olympics break is going to be subject nine where we have the fid the female fiddler who can kind of put up you under a magical spell when she fiddles her violin which is going to create some kind of memes online anyway guys let me know everything you think about the flash season four down below please like subscribe and comment like always and i will catch you in that comment section very soon guys but first join team war stew by hitting the bell button down below so you never miss any of my videos and i will catch you in a video very soon which will be my black panther review i've not put it up yet because i just don't want to i want to allow people to watch it give it a few days and then i'll probably put it up on saturday or sunday most likely anyway guys i will catch you in another video very soon guys catch you later